All right, here we are again at 824. My ribs have been thawed out, washed and patted dry, removed the membranes by using a fish skinner, and now I'm applying my dry rub. I know it's called a rub, but I'm not going to rub it in. I'm just going to let it seep into the meat. And I like to use a lot of it. So I'm planning on putting these on about 11 o'clock, smoking them five hours to about four o'clock, and then let them rest a little bit. With my ribs, if you use any uh, barbecue sauce, it's only to eat it with. I don't use it to cook with. Alrighty then, they're going to have about two and a half hours to sit and marinate and soak up all that wonderful flavor. Alright, now we just wait. Alright, here it is, about 10.30 in the morning. We're going to get the grill fired up, see if we can get the right exact temperature we want, and then I'll let it sit there and kind of stew for a while, and uh, bring the ribs out here at about 11.30. I'm going to start by putting some charcoal down in here. Like I said, I'm using the propane for heat, the charcoal and wood chips for flavor. Alright, I'll turn on the propane, fire up my magic grill starter. And here we go. 
Now I'll shut the lid on the big part, turn this down a little bit. I want to get up to about 225 degrees. Ah, barbecuing in December. I think the thermometer went into hiding. Bear with me, my tripod's not very sturdy. So the first thing I'm going to do is put some water in my pan that's going into the firebox to keep everything nice and moist. Step number two, add some hickory chips. We want some smoke. Got my smoker box right on top of the coals. Got my temperature right at 225 degrees. Now I've got three racks here I'm going to put on, and I hopefully they will turn out awesome. The rub just smells delicious. So, all right, there we go. Three racks of baby back ribs. Mmm, got that rub on there. Starting to get some smoke coming. Oh, yeah, get a good fire, get the smoke rolling out of that box, and five hours later, we'll have magic. All right, here we go. We're a little over an hour in. Oh, look at that smoke. Oh, delicious, delicious, delicious. I'm going to add some of my special glaze here. Help keep it moist. When it gets about halfway done, gets a nice smoke ring on it, a nice crust, I'll uh, add some mopping sauce to it for the final bit of preparation. Check on our fire. Oh yeah, doing well, doing well. All right, here we go, five hours in the smoker. Don't those look delicious? Oh. All right, now we're going to plate these things up here. Now it's always good to cut next to the bone, that way you get a good piece of meat. Oh, look at that. You got a nice smoke ring, a nice crust, and lots of juicy, juicy meat. That's the way ribs are supposed to be done. Hope you enjoy it.